week. We're getting back into another stream here today. Today we're going to be hitting up some MLB The Show as we continue our charity stream event to raise awareness for Stop Soldier Suicide. Great organization. Their whole purpose and goal is to raise awareness for uh, military and veteran suicide rate. Their goal is to try to get that rate down to at least 40% by 2030. They're a great organization. Links are, are in the uh, the chat. Exclamation point SSS. Go check them out. Show them some support. Show them some love. But, and then also, you know, if you know anybody, any if you're a veteran or active duty military or have anybody that fits one of those categories and they're going through a rough patch in their life, I just need someone to talk to. Exclamation point 22 is the, uh, going to give you the link to uh, Veteran Crisis Hotline. Great people over there, great counselors, great resource to help to help our vets, you know, to help prevent them from uh, committing suicide and everything. But uh, without further ado, you know, we got MLB The Show 23 coming out this next month. You know, what better way to uh, kick off the old rest and prep for the game, especially with base with spring training and full swing for baseball right now. Let's get into some MLB The Show 22. It's been a while since I touched this game. I do have some very, some very leveled up characters that I, I run with. So we're starting a new road to the show. I have a character that is 92 overall that we're going to be playing. He's a catcher. Don't be alarmed. It's just because when this game, when the game first comes out, I really play MLB the show heavily hard. Sorry, got the toddler running around. Stream, streaming dad here. But yeah, so uh, this is one of my favorite games. Baseball is one of my favorite sports. I play this game religiously almost when it when it comes out with each new uh, edition that comes out. So that's why you're going to see me playing as a level 92 character with a lot of diamond gear. Because I spend a lot of time and put a lot of effort into grinding to get my characters where they are. So we're going to start a new profile, fresh run. It's been a long time since I touched this game, so I have the dynamic tuned down, the dynamic uh, batting and all that tuned down just a little bit, just to get the hang of batting in MLB The Show again. So you might see me really beasting it up at the plate, it taking longer for me to progress through, um, through the batting difficulty level. And it's just because the only reason behind it is because it's been a long time since I played this game. Timing, my timing is going to be god awful. So I turned it down a little bit to get used to, you know, timing the pitches and watching pitches and all that. So we'll see how this goes. But uh, without further ado, let me get this. Let me get this music back up in the game. Rex Ridgeway, who's going to be a catcher. Go. Good. Good. We're gonna use 
Kurt. We're back Rosters? at it with another right. season of Let's the Road to the Show podcast. Live. I'm your host, Ben Gelman. Today, we're focusing on the Major League Baseball amateur draft, specifically on one of my diamonds in the rough. This is a player, not a household name yet. There's a long way to go. Maybe not at the top of the draft class, but I, I think there's a real future at the Major League level for this player. I have Hall of Fame outfielder Ken Griffey Jr. with me today. Ken, what advice would you give this player who might not be considered a sure thing to make it? What would you tell them as they begin their professional journey? Yeah, I mean, you have an opportunity. Anytime you have an opportunity to, to impress somebody, uh, uh, to go out there and, and do something, then you can do it. And, and they don't care, you know, who you are, what round, what this, what that. They just want you to go out there and play. And if you can perform day in and day out, you will be in the big leagues. With the MLB draft already underway, a young prospect shares his expectations with a former coach. Have you been talking to particular teams, Rex? I just want to play ball for the club that wants me the most. No favorites you're pinning your hopes on? No, sir. That's probably for the best. Now, not yours to decide anyways. All right, thanks, coach. I don't want to tie you up. Good luck, son. All right, here we go. Let's see who drafts us. Carlos, you lived that in your baseball career. What's this world like? Oh, it's extremely exciting. You know that if you perform, you will get the call. We've got a developing story here. JP, what are you hearing? I'm checking the numbers. I'm talking to my sources, and my scouts, and they're all telling me, hey, this could actually work. Most of us mere mortals, when we were that age, we were barely chewing gum and walking at the same time, let alone playing the hardest game there is. Let's see if he's tough enough mentally here to adapt. That's what good players do. That dream of getting the big leagues is now becoming reality with that one phone call. Uh, uh, got drafted by the Angels. Uh. What? Are you kidding me? This is who we are drafting? You must be crazy. He is a career minor leaguer. He's not a major league player. We wasted a draft pick, a high one at that. Here, this is why we don't win. This is a terrible, terrible pick. Oh, my goodness gracious. Come on, fellas. I mean, at least work? I have the chance Do to catch for Shohei, Shohei Otani. I hate this pick. Ugh. I'm with you. As you can't tell, I'm a Rangers fan. I I, I despise the Angels. <laughs> We're one of our rivals. All right. We're talking about one of my favorite picks in this year's MLB Amateur Draft, and I'm joined by mental performance coach Kellen Lee. Kellen, what have you heard about this particular prospect? You know, I, when you sent over the list of, of people we're going to talk about, I had to do some extra research on this one. This is a guy that I, you know, flew under the radar and I really wasn't as familiar with. Uh, but after doing a little bit more research, uh, talked to some coaches, talked to the people that know him personally, it sounds like he's got some really strong intangibles. Sounds like he was a great teammate as an amateur player. And I would imagine that the organization perhaps did their homework a little bit and found out a little bit about him uh, that other teams didn't because it sounds like he brings a lot to the table on the, on the mental side of the game. And as Yogi Berra famously said, baseball is 90% mental, the other half is physical. Now, math on that aside, Kellen, how much has baseball emphasized mental toughness, mental development in recent years? Yeah, there's been a huge shift and a lot of the organizations and players are turning to the mental side of the game to be just a regular part of player development all the way from the minor leagues all the way up to the major leagues. Uh, some of those mental performance skills include building confidence, establishing routines, uh, setting really effective goals, maintaining motivation, visualization, the sky's the limit. But really what we know is that a really solid mental game allows these players to tap into their physical game more consistently. Come in, come in. All right. <laughs> so the first game we go. Make sure we have catcher loadout equipped. Make our, oh, oh yeah, I forgot. The double A team is the Rock City Trash Pandas. AKA Raccoons. 
And welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you. Oh, it's raining. Opening day 2022 on MLB The Show. It's the Rocket City Trash Pandas and the Birmingham Barons. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Almost ready to get underway. And today's starter, Kyle Kuba. He may not dominate, but he always keeps the club in the game. If you can score runs, you have a really good chance to win with him on the mound today. So up next, Rex Ridgeway. This guy has turned into a beast. If you're trying to keep the line moving, this is the guy you want at the plate. Such a good hitter. Can also flash some power. That one is absolutely into the corner, crazy. baby. And it hits the fence. Lead runner holds at third. So two runners. There we go. Position and just one out. Good and rip right off the start. For a souvenir. It's his first base hit here in double A. For sure. And if he can pick up a bunch more of those, he'll hopefully keep moving up the ranks towards reaching the big leagues. That's the old change up right down the middle. I'll take career. that. Had a runner on first, so I'm going to sit to the Isabel left field. We'll hit next. One down, runners at second and third. On the ground. Oop, 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 Rivera hold. picks it up, throws across the diamond, we'll but get the score. Run comes in to score. All right. Here's the third baseman, Jose Rojas. All right, Rojas. Ridgeway at second with two down. Hot shot to oh, yeah, go, baby. Go, go, go. Turn two. Or turn two. Turn, turn, turn three, go home. They lead by two. And he's in at second with a two-out double. Well done. Drives in the run. 110 that miles per cool. hour. And, man, well, that cool. exit velocity. Not good. every hitter's capable of getting that kind of jump off the bat, no matter how hard they swing. Back here at the ballpark. Here's the speed. All player, right. Rex here we go. Ridgeway. This guy, one of the best defensive catchers going. You talk about framing, the ability to block, catch, and throw. He is at the top Someone's of the game. Go straight up. And there's a rocket into the outfield. Now he'll turn for second, and that's going to roll to the wall. Can Around I get three? Can now, I cut three? three. And oh, yeah. I can get a triple. The triple. Woo. Two wins for him in this one. Both for extra bases. Got to feel good about that. Nice. He that ball, but he didn't have to, man. When you're working the ball gap to gap, there's so much open space out there. So I think that knock was all about his approach and that willingness to just let the ball get deep on it. And next will be the cleanup hitter. Ibondel Isabel grounded out his first time. In the it's air, up. Left we field. hold. Randolph. On the move. There you go. There you go. Grab. Runner tags from third. Cut off. Now a throw home. We're there, baby. He scores. And they take a two-run lead. Oh, well, that's a quality at bat right there. You know the situation. You need something in the air and deep. One down. And now the catcher comes up to him. Rex Ridgeway. The catcher. Difficulty has increased. Oh, he hit, oh, he hit me, baby. You know, anytime one of your guys gets drilled, it catches everyone's attention in the dugout. And you know what? It kind of gets you fired up. So first and second with one man gone. And now the first baseman, Ibondel Isabel. He's 0 for 1. Bounce to the right what? side. Yeah. Oh, great stop. He hit. Right throw, and it gets away. Oh, yes. That was lucky. That one really. That was, yep, I was gonna say that. Definitely an error. Puts you even further behind. Just can't let it compound from here, though. You gotta flush it. Get ready for the next one. Oh, threw it right by him. So one out with two aboard. 
Next to hit, Jose Rojas. Swings and misses, two down. Well, he didn't get the call on the mound the pitch before. Felt like he should have had him look it, I think. But, you know, that's good composure right there. He found a way to come back with another good pitch to get him to swing and miss. So first and second with two outs. Here's All the right. left fielder, Alexander Let's get back to Ramirez. This, yeah. We haven't seen a break in the weather, and the umpires might be forced to make a decision soon. Yeah, I think so, Boog. I mean, everyone looking and wondering when they're going right. to stop. Throughout. Definitely feels there we close. Go. Yep. And the inning is over. All right. You know what I've noticed is we need to move. And now Rex Ridgeway. This guy one of the best contact hey, men in the sport as well. Ridgeway. Outstanding on the defensive end. Pause the game real quick. I just noticed he's kind of blocking my camera here. Is kind of... Blocking the uh, remove the face cam up just a hair. That should put it out of the way of the scoreboard. Yeah, we can adjust it down just a hair. Oh, through that one. Oh, and one. Good. Yep, pitch I was right late there. on that. Anytime you can get one by a bat of this caliber, especially with runners on, it's got to give you some confidence out there on the mound that you can win this battle. Now the old one. They say you win. Oh. All right. Who we'll can anything close? At the belt and fires. And there's a ball. Hey, I need you right here. One time. And now two and two. See how the catcher wanted that pitch up and in. Want to try and tie him up. That's the one thing we're seeing. That high fastball. You have to get it up there because of how hitters have changed their swings. In the air. Yeah, I popped that up. Left center. Yeah, and yeah. Randolph makes the play, and there's two down. Now batting the first baseman, Ebondo Isabel. And stepping in is the speedy Rex Ridgeway. Now batting. He is quite an athlete. I mean, you look around the other sports, basketball, football, you feel like he could thrive in one of those sports. There we too. go. First pitch, just misses. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. Hey, let's go, big fella. The pitch. That one the other oh. way. Base hit. Oh, yeah. Get down. The throw in. Got him. Not in time. Oh. He's safe at the plate. Nice. It's a one. Picks himself up in RBI. Nice job of driving that pitch. The nice other little way. RBI oh, blooper they single. The they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite. Take that. Field. It doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. And here's the first baseman, Ibondel Isabel. Oh, so he got me. Yeah. Ridgeway, yeah. The run down now. There the out. Runner scores from third. Unless you're really thinking about stealing second base, you should not get picked off by a right-handed pitcher right there. It's always nice to grab the Yep, he got series. me. He caught me cold. Sometimes things aren't as comfortable as what you've been used to. The mound doesn't look straight. 
the background isn't what you like, but they didn't know we had a good we did good looked like they were playing a home game. Excellent job to set the tone for this. We went three for four with RBI, triple, double, single ten entire crew here at MLB the show. Thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chomby. Talk to you soon. They left 17 runners on base. Your catcher. We're live from Industry Center Stadium. Right, Double so A baseball on the show <laughs> coming your way. It's the Rocket City Trash Pandas and the Birmingham. The wind is blowing Bandits. left to right. First pitch coming your way next. So just about set now, and on the hill here today, Kate McClure. Well, he throws the change in the slider off the fastball. I really like how he's able to sell fastball, but it's really change up. And so he likes just out in front he likes to bit. throw a change Swing up. Miss, soft contact, the slider as well. He prefers change up and All three the slider. And hitters are going to have to stay back and make sure they get pitch recognition. All right. Here we go. That's ripped to right. That's foul. One. Out to short. And we round it. Collects. Which All right. That's out. All right. And that'll do it. Give me a moment. I got to take a phone call real quick, y'all. Hello. All right, we are back. Let's get back to this. All right, the uh, the boss lady hadn't was calling me. And kiddo was 
I'm like a bout of morning sickness. It's weird. It's like two days in a row that, that that's happened. Number one and we're, we're trying out. to figure out no why it's happening. So two down. Yeah, the batter now, Rex Ridgeway. A guy who makes an impact not just at the plate, but also in the field. All right, we're out for and one. This is a guy Ground out in the first. just impact the game defensively. They count on him to deliver offense. He's the first guy at the ballpark. He's got a steady. Yep, that was down the middle. Hitters. He's got to get familiar with his starting pitcher for that All night. Right. And he's getting in the cage to take his swings. That's a whole lot, and so many times goes unnoticed. Early on that with that slider. You got me. The 0 2 stays alive. Out that off. That slider's he's trying to get put me away with a slider. Two down. We gotta watch out for the changeup. He's probably gonna go off speed or fastball. Gonna count one yeah, and two. High fastball. Let it fly. Let's go right here. Alright, now that he's done that, he's probably gonna go a change up. And a ball leaves. Yep, change up away. Uh, he, I'm thinking either a fastball or a slider again. Swings slider. The and it's a strikeout. Damn. And that will end the inning. Nine minutes. Plate four. So the lineup flips Doing over. Doing good with this one. All right. DJ Burton. Laboring here. About to throw his 30th pitch of the inning. Squares and gets it down the left side. Over to first. Got him. And that's the inning. Now the left fielder, number 23. All right. We're going to have a, someone trying to steal second. Here's the pitch. Run around the goal. That's in for a strike. Got him. Got him down. What? No way. Two two now. now a drag bunt, third base side. Come on. Here's the speedy All pitcher, right. Rex Ridgeway. That was rough. Singing, now, he's a guy that covers that's... both sides of the plate about as well as Ridgeway. anyone in the sport. How difficult is that to do? Well, I'll just look at the back of my bubblegum card. You'll see how hard it is. These guys are great, man. They have the ability to look out there, but also to be able to turn on the inside pitch. Those that can really sharpen things on the outer half, those are the ones that become elite. Run around the goal. Pitch misses in. And that's a stolen base, not even close. Well, he picked right. up once just before the pitch to check on him, but that didn't seem to slow up his jump on the pitch at all. I think that guy's been studying some video. Awesome job to be prepared. Got the timing down, and he gets into scoring position. Hey, here we go, big guy. Come on. The 1 0. That one. There we go. There we go. Get out of here. Home run, baby. Woo hoo hoo. So he leaves the yard first to home the run. Tack on to their lead. It's six two, and a nice moment for him there. One he'll certainly remember. That's his first double A home run. And trust me, getting that first long ball. Oh boy, out of left play, that one hanging. Comes as a nice relief, and not just left for that him, pitch but hanging. As well. They're hoping he ends up being a major part Look at of that. the league club. Right years. over the middle, left that ball hanging. Basically, put that on a tee for me. Now, here is Rex Ridgeway, one for three. He is quite an athlete. I mean, you look around the other sports, basketball, football, you feel like he could thrive in one of those sports, too. Hey, looking for yours now. Come on, kid. In there, and it's on one. Oh. oh, man. I mean, oh, nice that was dirty. Presenting it to be better than it actually was. On the ground, out to short. Yeah. The throw to first. Yeah, me on that one. And that is that. So digging in, Rex Ridgeway. This go. is a true it's five a tool guy. Not very many of them out there, but when he's on the field, you can't take your eye off. 
first pitch not close fans come to the ballpark to watch him play and in baseball to have seen. such right. a talented I think he's player probably going out there try to go off speed with this and one putting on the show yeah. that he does no. just a joy to watch poor seam in the dirt all right got yeah, next thinking he's gonna try to go off speed here next off we're seeing in the dirt down again down three no we're holding all the way Good plate appearance there. And we walked. Able to take the walk. Boog, do you think you could draw a walk in the bigs if we gave you enough at bats? Oh, that's a good question. Um, I think that if they gave the pitcher on, a now, full scouting right report on me, yes, I think I could draw a walk. Get your pitch and drive it, kid. Here you go. Now a screamer into the outfield. He dives oh, oh, oh. can't make the catch. Oh. They get it in quickly. So oh. First and second, now one out. I had to really check up hard because well he, he came in way nice too close on that. Right there to use the big part of the field. Look at this. Watch this. On time. He stayed balanced through oh. the entire swing. He was that one just that seven. much from from first catching and that second, and catching out. me. Luis Rangifo now at the plate. Hit in the air, right field. Ah, that's too shallow. No trouble here. Puts yeah. it away for the out. Two away down. Yep, that was too shallow for me to check up on that. Now batting. Designated hitter. Next is the designated hitter, Alexander Ramirez. Here you go. And a pitch. Swing and a miss. And that's and in. And down on strikes for the third beginning. straight at bat. For the traditional. Here's the power hitting catcher, Rex Ridgeway. He is at the top of the game in terms of defense at the catching spot. Oh, bases are loaded. Oh, this guy throws a multitude of shit. Yeah, right up the middle. Base hit, baby. And we're going to hold. And he's in there as they score a pair on the play. There we go. Right there, he does a great job of staying in the big part of the field. Now Man, there are a lot the of hits there. He bundled Isabel. Now here is Ibondel Isabel. No matter on, what, baby, you're playing this kind All of game. Right. Take your game to another level. Kicks and fires. Run around the move. That to right. Nope, nope, nope. I got picked off. Runner tagging from third. To the play. Save. And the lead continues to grow. Man, there's a sack fly to bring home another run in this inning. These guys are just piling it on. We're seeing some really yeah. quality advantage. You know, he should have gone right first there. and picked me off. Digging in. Luis Rangifo. A switch hitter batting right. One and two now. Here comes the pitch. There goes the runner from first. He swings and hits a fly ball. Set Dog it. Cespedes pulls it down. To I'm going to need these guys to stop hitting pop flies directly to now players. The designated hitter. Now it's going to be Alexander Ramirez. And here it comes. To the right Whoop. side. And it gets by him. Throw in holds the lead runner at second. Two on now with two away. So All two right, on with two away. This. Digging in is the switch inning outfielder, Deshaun Knowles. Here comes a pinch. And down on strikes. That's out number three. All in all, ten come to the plate. They bat around in five scores. Go. 
We won. If you win by nine runs, you have plenty of insurance runs. It's a huge confidence boost when you can just put that many runs up on the board. And I'll tell you what, the next game starter is saying, hey, I hope you guys save some runs for me. I want to get a win as well. 14-5 is your final. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Shambi. Thanks for joining us. Time of the ball game. Four hours and 18. All right. We went two for five with a home run and four RBIs. Not bad. We also had a walk in that game. Increased your stats, which is good. Building it. Increased. So. Cool. Uh, we are catcher. Welcome, thanks for joining us. Some double A baseball coming at you. Afternoon night it's game. The Rocket City Trash Pandas and the Birmingham Barons. First pitch coming your way next. Just about to get started, and on the hill, Felix Paulino. Well, because he doesn't have plus stuff, it's going to be critical that his skipper keeps a close eye on it. The second time, third time through the order, we see the OPS jump dramatically. One gone runner at first. All right, here we go. Rex Ridgeway, good contact guy, good defender. If you're trying to keep the line moving, this is the guy you want at the plate. Such a good hitter. Can also flash some power. Polino, keeping him close. Another move to first. Well, he is and he's back again. really trying to make sure that he stays there, huh? All right, here we go. Oh, that was way too high. Bad, bad on me. I was hungry. I was chomping at the bit for a pitch. To go for a double play. Righty to the plate. This one. There we go. Down the left field line. If it's fair, it's gone. It's fair, and it is. There gone. we go. His second of the year, and it gives him the lead in the first. Home run. It's two nothing. Well, that one won't stay below the radar. That made a lot of noise. Chris, that ball came out hot. So let's see what Statcast has right to off say. the sweet spot, yeah, really right down the line. 11 miles per hour off the bat, and a really nice launch angle as well. Just a beautiful swing from start to finish. And at first, all right, we're gonna try to gun somebody down. Runner on the go. Pitch in for a strike. And he made great it. Great jump. Two outs is a great time to try to steal second, especially when you have a guy with some wheels on first. Defense probably knew it was coming, but figured we better focus on trying to get this hitter out. Now the catcher up to hit Rex Ridgeway. This guy wanted. I wasn't the best too worried about gunning that guy down because we already had well. uh, outstanding on the defensive end. Had two outs. First offering. All right, the high Good fastball. Speed on the base pass. He handles the bat very well. I wouldn't be surprised if the skipper puts on some Let type of hit run seed. or run and hit. Fastball and action. Good eye That's right there. Chris, with that distraction and the speedy guy at first, he's in a favorable hitter's count. Well, if nothing else, I mean, this is a great spot. Ah, got me with the slider in. there. All right. Two one now. That's ah. a good approach right there. You want to get something that's just a little higher that you can elevate. All right, anything close. Play. Anything close. 
the ground to a double play. Damn. Two. On the second, they get one on the first double play. And that's the damn, end. Damn, damn, damn. Runner at first with two away. Mm. All Here's right, here we go. Rex Ridgeway. How about it? Singy, you can't ask for anything more. This guy checks all the boxes offensively. He is the ultimate professional, and it doesn't just start one on. in time. It starts in the afternoon the way he prepares and gets ready for the ball game. I tell you what, his teammates feed off of uh, the leadership. That looks like it was going to hit. And off the field. Change up. And a pitch. And it's even up. Number 27, the runner at first with all two balls. Right. Right there. In the air, left, left that slider hanging. No, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah. Brings it in for the third out. So up next, Rex Ridgeway. He's already homered here oh, in this God. one. That's right. been such a good hitter with runners in scoring Ridgeway. position. Some guys just take it to another level. For him right now at the plate, it's like everyone else is in slow motion, and he's in full speed. At the middle. the middle. And it gets by him. We'll get that RBI. They were playing double. They were uh, split the zone down the middle. To, uh, the double play that. Gotta make them pay. Now batting. The first baseman. Yvonne Gold. Isabel. We'll roll it. Send it right up the middle. Cleanup hitter. Yvonne Isabel. Next pitch has popped up. Puts the squeeze on it, and there's one down. All right. So first and second with one man up, gone. Luis Renjifo gets a chance to hit here. Yeah. Well, both sides equally as strong. So not a good time to try to turn him around with a relief pitcher and put him on the other side of the plate. Ground ball right side could be two. Steps on the bag for one. And that's, that's two. two. All right. End of the inning. Here's the catcher to hit. Xavier Fernandez. All right, we're going to have a steal. Now this guy's definitely looking for a big swing of the bat right here. Try to close that gap. But, you know, at the very least, if it... here goes the runner. Pitch in for a strike. Throw save. That's nope. a stolen base. Stolen base. Well, nice oh, we won that game. Way to finish this series. You're headed Playing to baseball. City for another one. You've got to maintain the same focus. Whatever you were doing in this city, make sure you're doing the same thing in the next one. All right. Well, that ends, ends that series. We went two for four. Not too bad. Check the inbox out. For me, they're bumping Michael Cruz, catcher to triple A. Where they plan to use him off the bench, and now you know the rest of the story. Well, it's like I'm going to be full time starter for the double A team. A double A hitting coach. Rex, if you're looking to maximize your development as a hitter, Betty Cage is open on off days too. Good to know. Thanks. Your off days are your own, but every bit of extra time you can commit to developing your bat skills will make a difference. Give it a try. Jonathan, he's shown us what he can do against pitchers' mistakes at this level. As he rises up the ladder towards the majors, those mistake pitches are going to get fewer and farther between maybe one or two per week even.
Yeah, especially if you're a star, you get pitched around more and more. He's already starting to see some of that at the minor league level because he is maybe the best hitter on, on his team, especially with the way he's been swinging the bat right now. So it's taking advantage of those opportunities, learning when to expand the zone a little bit without getting out of your approach. So if you see a pitch that you know you can drive, you, you don't miss it. Uh, you know, this is such a game yeah. of oh, failure. Nice. You know, if, if you go one out of three, you're a Hall of Fame player. That means you're failing 67% of the time. He seems to understand that. So even if it's a 4-for-4 four four game, if it's an 0-for-4 oh game, he's the same guy when he gets to the ballpark the next Kurt day. Kurt Suzuki. Wow. your cards for you. There you go. Welcome. All right, we're on a three-game win streak so far, which is pretty nice. Let's get, uh, let's go league leaders. I'm uh, currently in second in batting average. Tied for second for hits. triple currently second on home runs currently tied for first for rbis and close that there you go tied for fourth on runs haven't had a chance for stellar base yet haven't really been blocked yet Currently in second for base percentage, second for slugging. Second for OPS. Shut up. That's all the offensive stats. All right, well, did that batting cage? Let's see, what do we want to work on? Contact. Like, our plate vision or Yeah, let's work on our plate vision. In this session, you will see various types of balls along with normal baseballs. Your goal is to only hit the baseballs in the strike zone. So move the PCI, that, and press A. Ugh, I hate this mini game. those two that those all right good job three got, got that max gain for that cool 
Got a game off, and now we're back in the lineup. Starting catcher. Number three in the rotation. Let's grab a drink while it's lined loading up. Welcome to Majestic Green Stadium. Minor League Baseball from the AA level coming up. It's the Pensacola Blue Wahoos and the Rocket City Trash Pandas. Oh, looks like we're the home team tonight. Cool. First pitch coming at you right after the break. All right, ready to go here. Today's starting pitcher, Cooper. Oh, Christmas. man, look at that ERA. Anytime you have five pitches to work oh. on the mound, that repertoire <laughs> can be a good weapon in terms of keeping hitters off balance, man. It's, it's one of those things that I'm going to be looking for in this one. Does That's he have good. a feel for the all catcher. of those pitches, or is he just right. able to get one or two over right. in the strike zone where he wants? Four seam circle change, two seam. All, all right. Pitches, but if he can, he is going to be very tough. To Chop that. Today. In plenty of time to first, that ends yep. the inning. End of one, and we're still scoreless. Corey Bird digs in now. Over Bird is the word. Wyatt. He's someone that you might not describe as having elite level speed, but he can absolutely move, and it is a factor in his game. Now a bunt towards third. Not in time, and he reaches safely. <laughs> two strike hitting right there, Boog. A bit of a lost start for some, so that was nicely done to beat the odds. Yep. They actually kind of fooled him with the breaking ball on the inside part of the plate there. Didn't get a good piece of it, but he got just enough to fight it off and make it work out. And now the catcher comes up right, to him. They're up Rex by one. Ridgeway. This guy now makes great catcher. contact. One of the best in the game at putting Ridgeway. bat on ball. He's got such quick hands, and he's gaining pitch recognition. Get on base after taking the first pitch. Play. Contact swing for a hit. Power swing for a hit. A long time, and that produces solid contact consistently. Yeah, let's go for a power swing, baby. Tomorrow, PG, thank you for the follow. That one fouled off. Welcome to the stream, family. And the pitch. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. That's back there. And it's off the top of the wall. And he'll make it into the with a triple. Well, that'll make you feel good as a hitter right there. Got a fastball, middle of the plate, jumped all over it. Absolutely smoked that ball. Nice. Two more, we might have gotten it over that wall. Batter now, Ivondel Isabel. His first hit bat was a strikeout. All right, baby, get me home. And now the lefty. Now a slow roller to second. Aviles gloves it, but the game there we is go. tied as the up. comes in. They'll expect a back and forth this entire game because of how good the offenses are. So digging in, Rex Ridgeway. Pretty amazing athlete this guy is. Right, this picture is getting up there. Threat. I mean, you're talking about someone that could steal you back. Plenty of energy. Bo Jackson, anyone? First pitch doesn't find the zone. Hey, let's go, big fellow. This is right here. The pitch. Right. And a guy there. I'm going to make him work for this one. Knowles gets his lead at first with nobody out. That was in there. Right there. Challenged him with the 2 0 fastball. Not sure exactly what he was looking for, but got to imagine that's a confidence booster on the mound. You're in that hitter's head a little bit. On a line. Yeah, line out. There's one away. Not fooled at all right there. He was clearly all Darn. over it, but sometimes you hit it too hard and right at someone. You're looking for one of those. Rex Ridgeway, the next to hit. All right. He's kind of an outlier, especially when guys are consciously sacrificing contact to deliver power.
Here's a high fly ball out to center. Burdick. God dog. I just can't make good contact in this game. Now batting. First baseman. Yeah, I couldn't make any good contact that game. One to four with a triple. That's all right. At least we won the game, though. Up and down the lineup, pitchers are pitching. Guys are making the plays defensively. This is the kind of feeling. It's not going to last all season long, but you want to ride it as long as you possibly can. Perhaps push it up to double digits. And your final score here today, two one. <sighs> Hello, baseball fans, and welcome. Double A baseball on the show coming your way. It's the Pensacola Blue Wahoos and the Rocket City Trash Pandas. And we'll be back for the first pitch right after this. Ready to go. And our pitcher tonight, Jansen Jung. Right. Better pitchers is on the mound tonight. Uh, he's off to a good start, getting a win in his first start of the season. And so lifted a little bit of pressure. Right here, it's all about getting win number two. So two away with nobody on. And here's the catcher, Rex Ridgeway. This guy, one of the best contact men in the sport as well. Outstanding on the defensive end. First pitch, and he just misses. All right, here we go. Two down, nobody on. In the air, pretty deep out to center field. Yeah, left it hanging. Burden makes the catch, Damn. and that'll do it. That was a good pitch, too. And now the first baseman, Lorenzo Quintana. Now batting, the first baseman, Lorenzo Quintana. Rudder takes yeah. off. There's a ball. Oh. Throw to second. Great jump. And oh. that is a stolen base. It I thought that close. was going to be a wild really throw by me. What the situation is, when a guy like this gets on first, you know he's... Now the catcher up to hit. Rex Ridgeway. Now great catcher. speed and great power. A great athlete, Ridgeway. quite simply. He's like Mike Trout. You figure whatever you put in his hand, whether it's a bat, whether it's a golf club, whether it's a basketball, he can do it and get it done. And a rare talent, so much fun to watch. The next offering misses. Now 2-0. Change it to C, right? And he grounds one back up the middle. There Base we go. Hit. That was smoke through the infield. So a man of There we go. One on. Just so sound in his mechanics. Hits against a firm front side. And the hands just continue to carry through the middle of the field. Yeah, that one was going to be in the strike zone. Ivondel Isabel will hit next. Yeah, let's see if we can't get a steal on this one, huh? Leads off first with one away. Hey, be patient. Stay back. Get your pitch. Let's go. Here comes the pitch. Runner breaks for second. Swing and a miss. We got a steal. And he easily steals the bag. Now that's the third baseman. And now Jose Rojas. Lifted in the air out to the left. We're going. No All trouble right. here. Puts it away for the out. In the fourth, we couldn't tie it up. All right. Still plenty of baseball Set to play. The last half of the seventh. Stepping in, Rex Ridgeway. Chris, baseball today, so many strikeouts, and they are available to pitchers. But this is a guy that puts the bat on the ball and is kind of different from the players that we see day in, day out. That's the ah. Whips it across. Changeup got me. Well, he didn't recognize changeup earlier enough. Got out. The final one to nothing. Chris Singleton and our entire Damn. crew. I'm John Chompy saying so long. Our final line First for the victorious Blue Wahoos. One run, four hits, two errors. They left eight men on base.
We just couldn't climb out of that one. Oh, well, there's our first loss of the season. That's all right. And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're uh, with us. We got game. baseball coming up for Jackie Robinson Day. It's the Pensacola Blue Wahoos and the Rocket City Trash Pandas. First pitch coming your way next. Coming up on the first pitch, and on the hill in this one, Adam Seminaris. A really good outing for him last time. Scattered two runs, was attacking hitters, getting ahead in the count. Great performance. We'll see if he can do it again in this one. This feels about the bunt. Outs, nobody on. And now it's going to be Peyton Burdick. No score just getting started, top of the first. And he lays down a bunt. Sends it to Got first, him. third out, end of a half inning of play. So it's on to the bottom of inning number one, no score. Base is empty with two away. And here is Rex Ridgeway. It's interesting he plays kind of a, a power spot defensively, but runs pretty well. So when you're looking at that position, you're not expecting someone that has maybe above average speed, but he does. In one hops off the wall, should be extra bases. And he's got a double. Nice double right. right there. Loud contact coming off the bat. Didn't get enough air under to drive it out of here, but you'll take that swing and that result every time. Yeah, he left that pitch hanging. And it's scoring position with two away. And now, Ibondel Isabel. No hit to the shutout. All right, Ibondel. Hit you a hit. The pitch. The other way. There you go. Dig, 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 dig. He's safe. Got it. Well, that certainly feels good when you can win the at bat after being down in the count, up against Yo. it with two strikes right there. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good. It is on the board you first. Play. You trusted your hands. Welcome back. Set for the bottom of the third, and now Rex Ridgeway. I'll expect a back and forth this entire game because of how good the offenses are. Meyer back to work. All right, that's a good eye. Counts one and oh. Four seam slider change. All right, here you go. The why to kick the pitch. He hasn't wanted to challenge him. Both of those pitches off the plate away. Don't expect anything down the heart of the plate. You may just have to be patient and take your walk here. Misses with the 2-0. All right, full count. Straight outside the strike zone. Come on, baby, get your pitch up there. Right-hander kicks deals. Here we go. Two Swings here and blasts one left field. It in. Oh, come on. Try to take on the wind and left field right there. Oh. Too much traffic up in the air. Mother Nature won that one. It's hard to say, but I think that. Yeah, that was. That was a pitch I couldn't pass up on not swinging. That was right down the middle. So. Can also flash some power. Advance the runner, drive in the run. Let's go for drive in the run. Time before a rain delay is called. This rain is not letting up. Yeah, and if we do get a delay, the unfortunate thing is the clock's going to start ticking on these pitchers, and they won't be able to keep their arms warm forever if it's a long break and going to have to exit this game a little early. Number 42 over at second. Number 42 at first, two out of the inning. This one smacked out to left center. Get down. Oh, oh, yeah. Go, 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 go. Brigman. With a relay throw, it's offline. The run comes in. Nice. And they're up by three. 
Oh, here we are, third time through the order, and this is where we see the OPS jump up. Manager might have to go to the bullpen a little bit sooner than he anticipated. Woo. We got lucky he couldn't grip that ball. Man at second here with two away. And here's the first baseman, Ivondell Isabel, one for two. It feels like we might be headed towards a rain delay if the weather doesn't ease up, Chris. Yeah, the umpiring crew are going to pay attention to how the weather is impacting this game. And how many times do you think they're going to mention a rain delay? Ah, that ends the <laughs> inning, so we take a break. We Bryson talked about it, Jeremy. Might it bad? Down. Is it bad? These guys know they have to get going out of the gates, but you're not going to hear a skipper. You're not going to hear people really say that. The kick in the pitch. Runner goes. Strike in there. Throw to Got him. Yes. That goes to show you stealing a base is a tough thing to do and far from a sure thing. Pop time, 1.72 seconds. It's not easy to catch him, but that was a great catch and throw. Quick, not rushed, and accurate. Here's the catcher, Will Banfield, for the fourth time tonight. Now batting, catcher, Will He plays out one right here. Kicks and deals. And there he goes. Pitch in for a strike. Got him. Throw to second, out there, and the inning is over. We'll try to get in the scoring position, but a great catch and throw to end the inning. That's the way to pick up the pitcher. That was, I had that guy beat one away by a mile. At the play, Rex Ridgeway. He's got the power, but great contact skills. One of the best contact hitters in the game. In the oh. for strike one. Oh. Four seam curveball channel. This is the first guy I think I've faced that has thrown a curveball. And it's one and one. The wind of the pitch. So a foul ball oh, makes it one and two. Him. Down in the dirt. Ugh. <sighs> ah. Down on strikes. And he knew it. Oh, that curveball had some pretty good break to it. As you can see, the hitter just locked up a little bit. Thought it was a great pitch to hit, but sometimes you're looking for something else, and you can't hold it. Whether you're a season ticket holder or you just come to a couple of games a year, to see your team win at home, there's just something special about that. Good job by these guys to get it done for the hometown fans. 4-1 the final here today. All right, let's get to this next game. Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. Some double-A baseball coming at you. It's the Pensacola Blue Wahoos and the Rocket City Trash Pandas. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Just about ready to go. And on the mound in this one, Ryan Smith. What do you got on him, Chris? Four pitch guy, he's got some options to work with in terms of keeping hitters off balance. So we'll see how he decides to utilize those weapons through this start here and whether or not he's able to mix them all in early or if he wants to hold something back a little bit later, maybe second, third time through the order and give them something they haven't seen. It's tough when you know a guy's got that in his back pocket as a hitter, you really have to stay on your toes. That one down the line, and it goes. Change ups. Just Everyone's foul. change ups in the dirt. A one down. This to third. Lays out, but he can't squeeze it. They get him, but it was pretty close. It was a bang bang play at first, Singy. So let's take another look at the throw that made it possible to get the out. No doubt that 85 mile per hour heater was the difference on this play, according to Statcast. And it looked like a blur going across the infield from up here, and they just got the out. So the batting order turns over. Digging in, it's the speedy outfielder, number 11. Hey, no one down here. 
the 1 first offering. Runner goes. Pitch misses. Throw, and, they and he's out. Well, I really didn't expect him to try to steal second base because he had a very standard lead at best. If you're going to try to get there oh, safely, God, that was a you've terrible got to get lead. that lead. You've got to get a better jump. That was the difference between being safe and out. Two outs, base is empty. Now the number two hitter. Number one. Right, this guy's button. Number one. Three one now. And a bunt towards third. Yeah, no. Nope. And that's a bunt single. That was placed perfectly. Now batting. So two down now. And here is Bryson Brinkman. All right, this guy's going to steal. Runner on the go. That's in for a strike. Caught him stealing. Out at second. That ends the inning. Well, trying to get in the scoring position, but a great catch and throw to end the inning. That's the way to pick up the pitcher. And stepping in is the speedy All right. Ridgeway. Now oh for one, Ridgeway. he grounded out in his first at bat. Ridgeway. That one hammered center field way back there. Another pop fly? The warning track. These pop flies are getting ridiculous. Back to the top of the lineup, here's the left fielder, number 11. Now batting. Number 11. Steel, run. run around the move. Pitch in for a strike. Oh, and one. Throw to Got him. Out there. And that ends the inning. So one out, nobody on. Here's a speed threat, Rex Ridgeway. And this is a guy that doesn't just impact the game defense, slump, to but be you honest. count on him to deliver offense. He's the first guy at the ballpark. He's got a study opposing hitters. There he's we go. Familiar with his starting pitcher for that night. And he's getting in the cage to take his swings. That's a whole lot. And so many times goes unnoticed just so sound in his mechanics hits against a firm front side and the hands just continue to carry through the middle of the field now Ibondel Isabel one for two definitely wants to stay out of the double play here ball on the ground in the infield should be an inning ending double play here's the pitch run around the goal strike in there throw there safe that was close, but StatCast shows us why he so often seems to be on the safe side of these steal attempts, Chris. Yeah, you see that plus speed, and he needed every last bit of it to swipe that bag. Such a threat on the bases. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. Now two out. Man, I really like the ability to bounce back right there after not getting the no call. Bad. He probably should have got it. Didn't Second let it affect man. his focus. Yeah, he pitch, came back pitch. with another good pitch to get him swinging. So runner at second, two down. Luis Rangipo, the next to hit. Here's a one-two. Bounce to the right. Ditter handles the chance. Tosses the yeah. first. And that That's is in the inning. And welcome back. Leading hey, off, we've jumped ahead. Ridgeway. This guy, one of the best defensive catchers going. You talk about framing, the ability to block, catch, and throw. He is at the top of the game. A wind and a pitch. And first offering is fouled yep, off. That was in there. And he deals. Swing and a miss. 0-2. Oh, <sighs> to be at the top of the order here. You want to get it on. See if you can get a stolen base. Maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. The 1-2. One, Swing and a miss. That one in the dirt. Gets to it on to first. Has some trouble with it. Well, oh, that bat didn't count against me then. Ibondel Isabel will hit next. Three two now. Run around the goal. Slice to right. That's a base hit. The throw to third. Not in time. He's safe. 
pretty much a model no swing on that one as he ripped it into the opposite field gap. And I'm sure he's going to be watching that one back on video because that's the kind of swing you want to bottle. So many positives that led to that knock. Luis Rangifo now at the plate. Play depth. Two two down. Rip to third and caught. Takes it to the back himself, but he's back in time. The batter, the designated hitter, Alex Ramirez. Runners on the corners with one gone. Alexander Ramirez digs in now. Don't be surprised to ball on the ground to the corners that they come home with the baseball instead of going to first base. On the ground, two ball. Quintana over to second, back to first, double play. Double play. That's it for the inning. And now the right fielder, Corey Bird. He's one. already homered in this game. the word. Right. This is what stat nerds Boy. like myself might call a high leverage situation. Yeah, but that's true. Runner on the go. Pitch in for a strike. Throw to second, and he's out. Got him. You can see they're continuing to try to apply pressure on this pitcher who struggled a little bit. But the problem is you get caught right there. You're helping him out. You're giving him an out that he struggled to get. You want to maintain those base runners. Let some of those guys coming up to the plate that got some pop can hit the ball in the gap, drive in a couple of more runs. Great pitcher's duel. And yeah, we had him off. Point where each pitcher is trying to outdo the hmm. other, go a little bit deeper into the ball game. And for these guys, it really came down to a few key at bats. This was a fun one to watch. A 3 2 final score in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Shambi. We'll see you we soon. Went one for four with a single. In the professional ranks, players have to develop not just on the field, but in the weight room as well. Minor league manager Rachel Balkovec joins me. Rachel, how important is it for players to make that progress in their off-the-field training and conditioning? It is absolutely crucial, and I think that more and more, you know, when I first got in the game in 2012, it was relatively new, but now we're talking about if, if you're not doing it, you're behind. So every single it's hard to believe but every single player is lifting two times a week in season at least and that's that's through playing you know six seven days a week they're still lifting before the games which i, I don't think a lot of people understand True. you know how consistent they are and, and and how much that helps them to keep their energy levels up throughout the season A player new to his double-A squad gets a tip. When time allows, Rex, many players will work to improve themselves in training facilities or on the practice field. Cool. Check that out. Another look at a guy I talk about a lot on this podcast. You all know it. He is lighting it up at the plate and in the field at the moment. He's doing a great job in double-A, pushing for a call-up to triple-A. Sean Casey joins me today. Case, how close is he to being ready for that call? Well, you know, I think the biggest thing as a player when you're doing, when you're having success, you want to go. You know, move me up, get me going. As an organization, I think the philosophy should, should be success. Let him have success because success breeds confidence. And to play at the, at the next level, AAA and AA, you need that confidence. So I think as a player, you want to move. Be as on the road. Maybe you keep the brakes on and make sure he continues to have success before you make that call. And that can have a positive impact on his teammates, too. They have a guy like this excelling and succeeding at this level, and it helps raise their game and builds a winning culture. Well, it's huge. Anytime you're, anytime you're down in the minor leagues and you have one of the best prospects on your team that's playing at a high level, you want him to stay. You want him to stay because it makes the team better. So, you know, I think for, for everybody to keep him where he's at, to have, to have the success that he's having, it, it benefits everyone. Let's look at our stats. Twenty-eight bats, two home runs, an RBI, two steals. I need to work on the batting, to be honest. The batting is terrible. 
struck out three times. I need to work on my discipline. If we're being completely honest. I've kind of low-key gone into a little slump here recently, so we need to work on that. So, uh, we're going to pause here for a little bit, maybe a couple hours, take a break, get some, uh, I need to get some lunch on board, I'm starting to get hungry, so, uh, I want to thank you for coming out to, uh, this stream, let's go ahead and get this saved, save road to the show. So we're going to take a break here go so I can get some food in the system. I'm starting to get hungry, get the little one fed. So uh, we'll see you here in a couple of hours. I want to thank you for coming out. We'll see you. Uh, just uh, I'm going to send you over to somebody else that's uh, streaming for, um, if we got anybody else streaming for Stop Soldier Suicide. So, uh, you know, help us support. Uh, support this mission spread the awareness and uh we'll see you when we get back yeah all the roads we travel the journey of our lives take another picture before we say goodbye arm in arm we're standing standing side by side Memories fade, but legends never die. One last time, let's live for something. I can feel my blood, it's rushing. This ain't goodbye. We'll be back someday, and we will find our own way. Take control of our fate, and like a car with no brakes. Should learn, make mistakes, and we'll be back one day. Wanna go fast? No this energy's here to last. Not a glass half full of a flow that on. Gotta keep your eyes up on the prize. Only got one life, so it's worth a try. To find what makes you feel alive. That's the only way to live it right on. Uh. And now we're all doing our own thing. But I'll never forget our glory days. My mind is full of the memories, yeah. And I'll never forget what they meant to me. Don't worry, we'll be back one day to celebrate our glory days on. Uh.